Hello viewers, this is Achorafi once again. Welcome to this new video where I'm going to show you how to create a professional CB in a Microsoft Word document. So if you are a fresher or maybe if you have got a little bit of practical work experience, then this professional minimal CB is going to be helpful for you. As you can see, I have entered very little information, but all of these are very straightforward and highly uh, attainable okay so as you as you may know if there is one job post in this current situation or job market then there will be uh, if there are not thousands of applicants there will be at least hundreds of applicants so the interviewer or the person who is going to check out the CVs will have only five to ten seconds to uh, check and uh, SCB okay so the CB should have all the important informations in very short or uh, very little play, uh, pages okay so here I have entered my personal under my personal details section I have entered my important information such as my name my email address this is very important to get communicated or get contacted okay and i have entered my phone number as well and if if in case they need my address information to send me a letter they i have just entered my uh, house address as well so that they will be able to send me any uh, letter if they want okay and then here in education section i have entered my highly qualitative uh, degrees that i have got here okay although these are fake but i have entered the best degrees here okay as you can see so that the interviewer will not have to spend some extra time to uh, check my other informations okay so here in experiences as i have mentioned that this uh, cb is going to be for a fresher or maybe with a little experience based persons so here i have just entered a very basic thing here private tutor of seven english medium school students all of this has got or maybe a, a great students okay so I believe most of the students uh, who is going to write or who are actually going to write a English curriculum by Thai they will have this experience of uh, tutoring other students okay so this is going to work uh, from almost all of the uh, viewers they are going to watch my video okay and then after putting your experience you may uh, you may add your interest and other information but i don't think this is very important for this curriculum by today okay as i have mentioned the competition and the time of the interviewer has uh, the competition has the great numbers but the time of the interviewer has the less numbers or the less seconds as you may know okay so after putting the experience section i have just declared that i hereby declared that the information provided above is true this is very important to put okay and you should have entered all the informations that are actually genuine okay so here after putting this part uh, you have to put date uh, signature based okay date and signature uh, based so that you will be able to add a date here and then a signature here under here okay after printing it, printing it out okay so now i'm going to show you how to make this cb uh, from beginning okay so i am going to file and then going to click on new and click on blank document and here after opening this page you just have to go to layout and click on sites and click f4 size okay and let's put here uh, professional CV and let's make it a little uh, bold okay and then make it little bigger so maybe 26 is perfect and let's make it in the center line okay and now we should uh, make it in 12 and then give it a space and here we have to enter our personal information so let's put personal information okay so actually I should put this one into this part and as this is a heading I should increase the size to 16 this is looking better 
and then after 16 uh, giving it a size of 16 we have to place enter and then we have to uh, take a table okay here so click on insert table and let's put in three columns and four row okay and here we have to enter our name and then email phone address and this part should be merged at once as we are going to uh, add our image here so just drag and select these columns and actually rows and then click on merge cells okay and now i want to attach an image here so click on insert pictures and then take the picture that you want to place here okay and then resize the picture uh, so resize the picture all right so let's just keep it just like this and we're going to work on this after putting our other informations archography email uh, put your information okay fake number address house six telegram select all right so now let's just make some adjustments here uh, make it little bigger oops very mistake okay okay so these lines are in one line let's make it little smaller okay and now i don't want these borders to be appeared here okay and to uh, disappear them we just have to click here and then we have to click on the right button of our mouse then table properties and go to borders and shading click on known okay okay so our borders has been disappeared now let's work on this image a little bit more okay so we don't want these parts uh, in bold mode so here and name should have sprockets okay columns okay so here professional information if you want to give underline you can give here otherwise just it looks better without the underline okay oops mistake without the underlines okay and now we want to have we want to put let's see what was there educational information so let's put the educational information here so give it another space education and again we want to pick how many columns let's see one two three four and rows three rows so i'm going to click again insert tables and four columns and three rows okay and now degree board result passing year let's put the headings degree board then result passing year let's english honors oops ignore okay select first class let's copy this one paste paste okay 2017 oops no okay 16 all right so the latest one in the top and the other one in bottom okay 
or in the second line actually so i don't want them in bolt mode okay so here we have got the educational information and our personal information attached or added okay now it's time to add let's see what i have to add experience just uh write e x p r i e n c and then we have to keep a bullet point here and let me copy and paste this part okay let me just copy this part and i'm going to show you how to give this part here okay so i've just copied actually now i want to give a space like this okay i've just showed this one is by clicking on tab and i want to uh, put let's see what i have written the on the other a plus grades i'm just going to copy this part and paste and delete this one and then again i am just going to copy this part to save the time okay oops okay so we don't want this one here so click okay so it looks as like our previous one as you can see and now we have to put the date and signature info here under this line so click on tab and write date again tab 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 and then signature and we may give a little extra spaces here maybe it's okay so this is our cv so this is the process of creating a professional cv as a fresher on a microsoft word document okay so i hope this video was helpful to you and if you have found this video helpful please let me know by commenting below like this video to encourage me to make more videos or more helpful videos in future and please subscribe to my channel to get more updates in near future and i hope to see you in the next video thank you very much for watching